Welcome back everybody and today we're doing something fun and really easy actually. We're going to do smoked salsa and let's get to the prep. Now these, this is one recipe which is I tweaked myself and it's really good to have in your back pocket because you, if you're doing a smoke anyways, you can throw this stuff in, prep it way before your brisket or pulled pork or ribs are going to be done. And it's just fun to do and it tastes great. So I've washed everything. There's just a little bit of prep. And basically the ratio I have here to tomatoes, to jalapeno, garlic and onion is what the recipe is. Uh, if you want it hotter, just throw a couple more jalapenos in. All we're gonna do for these guys, chop the tops off. The onion, nice and simple here. Take these fat layers off. It really doesn't matter how you cut it at this point because we're gonna blitz it up and I'm gonna show you all that. But now we just want maximum flavor over the onion. Tomatoes, really simple. I'm gonna just take out the core here. Just like that. And I'm gonna cut them in half. And that's all we're doing for these guys. That's simple for that. We're not adding any salt and pepper yet. We're gonna do that when we actually combine everything. And the garlic here, we're gonna also have one head of garlic or to your liking, but we're gonna roast it. So all we're gonna do for the garlic is peel it, take the ends off and like that. We're not even gonna half it. We're not gonna do anything like that. I know it might look like a lot, but it, once you roast it, it's beautiful. It loses that really pungent, strong flavor, becomes more sweet and uh, really worth it. Trusty aluminum foil. Double it up. Get you guys on here. And just olive oil. Just a little bit of olive oil on there. And tightly seal that up. That's our little uh, package. And there we go, it's that simple. And let's go to the smoker. I've got it going already. It's at 250. Typically this is gonna take about two hours, two and a half maybe three depending on how much smoke you actually want on your veggies. Uh, play that by ear, but after two hours, we're gonna go check. Yeah, I know we're having some weird weather here. It's uh, really warm. When I do this, I like to keep the veggies on the cooler side so that I can control them better. It, it really is that easy and uh, we're just gonna get them in there now. And see you in a couple hours. Okay people, it's just over two hours and let's take a look. Ooh, that's looking good. But you know what, a little bit longer. We really want that smoky flavor. Okay, everything's inside, looks beautiful. It was just about two hours and 45 minutes. I'm just gonna actually let it cool down a little bit and then I'm gonna show you how to turn this into the salsa. There's honestly no trick to this. What we're gonna do, put in some of everything and then just blitz it down to the size we want. Uh, I don't know, I love this little food processor. It's gonna get loud. Ooh. 
We don't want it like a puree. It's still a uh, salsa. So I'm gonna I've got the onions first. Ah, oh, it's beautiful. Oh, the smell. Anyways, I'm gonna keep doing this. Let me do a few tomatoes. Just throw them in like this. Another smaller one. I know, if I had a bigger food processor, you could do it all at once, but it's the fun of it. And here we go. Tomatoes. And I'm going to just keep going and uh, get this done. And I haven't forgotten, we're still going to add a little bit of salt. And now this is to taste. Uh, because you have to remember, I didn't add any salt to anything before. I don't have fresh cilantro, but I got dried cilantro. I'm going to add a little bit of this too. If I had fresh, I'd use that. They didn't have any very nice looking stuff at the grocery store, so I, eh. And now, I'll give this a quick mix. Nice and chunky. It's not like baby food. It's not a puree. Okay, we got this all nicely mixed. We added the salt and everything. You know, I've been trying to play with my, well, making my own uh, chips. But I'm just not there yet, so I bought some. And uh, let's let's just dive in. That is so good. For me, I love the simplicity of this. You put in the ingredients you want. For me, it's at a very nice spice level. It's gonna be on the the hotter side. If you don't like it that hot, only add two jalapenos. Uh, if you want it hotter, add more. But uh, it just tastes so good. That, that smoke is on everything. And it just, oh yeah, just, for me it elevates the whole dish. And it's a, it's a very easy to do dish, which is awesome. And uh, I think you should try it. And have fun with it. Whew. Mm, that's good. And I think too, because you know exactly what's in it, the store-bought stuff, when you start reading those labels, you don't always know what all that stuff is. Here, I know exactly what I put in, what everything is, and uh, it's good for you. There's nothing bad in there. Guys, thanks for watching. Uh, have fun with this one. Enjoy it and uh, make lots. And uh, thanks for watching and happy eating.